Well, there's been a second day of unrest at Sydney's Villawood Detention Centre after the suicide of an Iraqi man on Monday. ABC reporter Simon Pallon is at Villawood and he joins us now. Simon, what's happening there right now? Well, protesters and detainees say they're very angry here tonight. They've set furniture alight. There's a couple of fires happening within the detention centre and there were a short time ago around five or six detainees up on the detention centre roof. They've since come down. Now, there's also an ongoing hunger strike happening here. According to some detainees, there are around 160 detainees who are refusing food. So while things look quite peaceful here just at the moment, it has been fairly volatile throughout the afternoon. OK, just briefly, what's prompted these protests? Well, this uh, unrest is a reaction to the death of an Iraqi detainee on Monday night. Friends of 41-year-old Ahmad al akabi say he was depressed and feeling guilty about his uh, wife and three children back in Iraq. Now, he came to Australia 12 months ago by boat and since then has had two applications for asylum rejected. Now, this uh, comes off the back of another detainee suicide around two months ago, and certainly the latest suicide on Monday night has reignited negative feelings here at Villawood, and they are on show here tonight. Simon Pallant at Villawood, thank you.